Getty Swansea boss Paul Clement is facing the Axe Swansea are bottom of the table and four points from safety, their 3-1 defeat at Everton on Monday the team's eighth loss in their last ten matches. American owners Steve Kaplan and Jason Levian have long planned to give Clement the chance to turn things around and hand him the opportunity to strengthen his squad in the January transfer window with at least three new signings. But with Swansea having won just three league games all season, Liberty Stadium bosses are growing increasingly concerned at the team's poor results and worryingly low confidence. Clement worked miracles to keep Swansea in the top flight after being appointed last January but he was never able to replace star men Jiffy Sigurdsson and Fernando Llorente who were sold in the summer. It left the 45-year-old going into his first season with a squad not well equipped enough to make a mark in the Premier League and the result has been predictable. Importantly, he still has the support of the players. Tuesday, December 19, 2017 Premier League Managers, how satisfied are fans we are behind Paul, he is a great manager and he did the job here last year Swansea star Tammy Abraham we are behind Paul, he is a great manager and he did the job here last year, said Swansea striker Tammy Abraham. We can do it again, we just need the right performance and for results to go our way, Paul lets you know when times are tough and when things are going well. He is honest with us, no matter what but heads are never down at training. We need to keep pushing and digging in, Swansea were bottom with just 12 points when Clement succeeded Bob Bradley and there was optimism at the start of this campaign of building on what was some impressive end of season form. It never materialized, with the signing of Bayern Munich loan flop Renato Sanchez summing up the Welsh team's woeful performances to date. Much like he did with a 1-0 victory over West Brom, there remains a feeling Clement must guide Swansea to three points against Palace or face the very real consequence of the sack. Asked if Swansea were playing for Clement's future this weekend, Abraham said, We cannot think like that. We know we have to show something and give everyone a good performance. We have the tools here, but it is about us as players producing a performance for Paul and doing as much as we can for him. Clement admits his current side's plight is something of an alien concept to him, but he is determined to battle it out. Having spent so long as assistant to Carlo Ancelotti at Chelsea, Real Madrid and Bayern Munich, Clement is used to those statistics being reversed. It is a difficult job being a manager, any team, any level, he said. You want to play well and win every game. As an assistant I was used to losing 1 in 10 and winning 9, now it is completely the opposite, it is not a nice experience but I'm learning a lot from it and learning a lot about myself, it'll keep fighting. I've worked hard to get to this position and I'm not going to give up on it. It'll keep going.